Hello Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome, cross watchers. Let's take a look and see what's manifesting for you all. Any messages, advice, who or what is showing up around you, what you need to know. Always take what's resonating, leave out the rest. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all social media. I am Spiritually Goldie on all platforms. If you are interested in a personal reading done by me, I will leave all of that info in the description box below for you all with the link to my website for you to view the different options for readings. Okay, so let's take a look. What's coming in for the Leos? We have the Fool, the Emperor, okay, King of Wands, Ace of Cups, Three of Cups, Five of Swords reverse. Okay. So this Ace of Cups is what's really catching my eye here because <laughs> we have this pearl and we have treasure. So there is some, some sort of like treasure that you're finding value, something very valuable that you are coming across here. An unexpected windfall will soon be yours. You will feel you have it all very auspicious time. Honestly, the, I'm really picking up like an engagement. I'm seeing a ring. I'm seeing commitment. I'm seeing something valuable. Um, but if you are single, this is, this is definitely a new relationship. I'm seeing commitment who you may end up being committed to it says you may get engaged or fully dedicate yourself to something that will be long lasting we have the fool the ace of cups this is a new beginning in love a romantic new beginning in love and you've done a lot of healing or you may be guided to continue this healing process that you're that you're in because it says you've been you've gone through a difficult initiation so you this whole time that you had to deal with that with the conflict the deception or like being played it was an it was an initiation it was that growth it was a lesson um which has prepared you for this which has prepared you for this new love which is is preparing you for um this treasure it, we have to be prepared to be able to keep the things that we're bl being blessed with Okay, even if it's not love, but it's like you're, you are being initiated here. Some of you are healers. Okay, I'm talking to my healers. Um, I'm talking to the people who have had very, very difficult upbringings, um, very difficult earthquakes in their in their lives. So it your you you your whole life has been an initiation process and you are going to gain now it seems like you're about to receive a lot more you're about to receive everything that you've um everything that comes from the lessons that you've learned you will feel like you have it all this new beginning in your life, this new era is going to feel like you have it all. Like I'm hearing needs being met, all your needs being met, feeling like you're back on track. So maybe you did go off track a little bit. Maybe you did um, take a risk and you fell, you know, but you're back on track. So some of you, it, you've reassessed your goals, but at this point, there is something new or a new strategy that you're coming up with that you're feeling very confident and motivated about. And it is, it is showing up very strongly that this is like, I, I'm hearing if there's a will, there's a way. This is something that is, is being made a way for you. I'm seeing communication. You have somebody who's about to message you. There may be a message from the heart trying to be expressed. Be mindful of what you say and use discernment. Emperor and the King of Wands here. Strong Aries energy. Strong Aries, strong fire. Um, does that have to be though? I'm also seeing Sagittarius, Leo, 
Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio here as well, but someone is going to be reaching out to you and it seems like they're reaching out because they do want a commitment with you. Okay. A message, a message about a commitment or somebody who wants to express that they are ready to commit, ready to have a new relationship in their life. If this is somebody new, this is someone who's going to communicate that to you. Emperor energy, like the emperor does not play around. Upright. <laughs> This person does not play around. They're not playing. I don't think they're playing games. <laughs> this person, they know how to build an empire. They know how to, they know how to create things and they're very serious about it. And they're, this is like monogamous type of person too. Okay. <laughs> Tell me about this emperor. Someone very mature. I'm getting a strong level of maturity from this person. Like they could be older or even if they're not older, they just have this like very wise, I'm, I'm picking up a wise soul. Someone who has a wise soul. Also, some of you are, are like older souls as well. And so you are attracting someone who also has like this same type of like old soul or, or I'm hearing like traditional type of values. Mm star this feels like a wish okay huh this feels like somebody who is someone who you would have like dreamed of or wished for who wants to provide protect you and this is someone who knows how to make dreams come true is what i'm hearing with that star energy this is someone who knows how to make dreams come true this is someone who wants to bring one of your dreams into a reality here okay strange very strange reading <laughs> why the fool okay okay so that i'm seeing where where you may have felt like you've had your bubble burst at, at a certain point you took a risk towards something you had um it didn't work out and and maybe you've really been kind of like struggling but you kept faith and you kept hope and you kept taking risks yeah this is this is a story of somebody who didn't let their failures stop them or stunt them from their treasure from getting back on track from their healing you continue to live a life where you don't let failures stop you king of wands you're in this energy right now where you have a lot of um you have a you have maybe gained a lot more confidence in yourself and i'm seeing people really gravitating towards you like people coming up to you, people noticing you, people being very attracted to you, you feeling good in your body, healthy, prosperous. Okay. Knight of Swords. Okay, you're very, you are quickly or urgently moving towards this, this new emotional beginning in your life. It feels like you are going through a very quick healing process right now. Every healing process you've gone through has made the process even faster or it's made it even easier. Tell me about this Ace of Cups. This new emotional beginning for you. The lovers. <laughs> and the four of wands at the bottom. That's funny. <laughs> I always try to like go into these readings, not trying to make it always about love, but like <laughs> I can't make this up. like I can't control what comes out. I'm sorry, but I do love love readings. <laughs> Ace of Cups and the Lovers. You're about to get into a very significant relationship with someone new with someone who is committed, with someone who's respectful, with someone who has values, 
um, level of maturity is like top tier, a top tier person for a top for a top tier Leo. Okay. Ace of Cups, a new emotional beginning, falling in love. I'm seeing a, I'm seeing you two coming together. This feels like a soulmate, like a healing process for the both of you that you've had to go through to bring you together into a union. Three of Cups, celebrating, having good times, going out. Your love life is about to get back on track here. I'm also picking up someone who may have been engaged in the past and it never uh, manifested into a marriage. That won't be for everyone, but I'm picking up on one specific person who has this type of, um, who've, who's kind of gone through something like that. But this feels like another chance or a new chance for you, Leo. A new chance in love, your heart opening up, not allowing past failures stop you from keeping your heart open and keeping an open heart to a relationship or a soulmate you're attracting a soulmate and th yeah this is new energy if you have someone in mind think of them let's take a look and see how they feel about you about this situation with you for the rest of the month the empress and the emperor <laughs> what is going on <laughs> This is divine masculine, divine feminine energy. Okay, hanged man at the bottom. So this has been in a limbo. This has been, um, like things have been really up in the air. You felt like you were kind of left hanging uh, and vice versa. Like this person has been waiting for you as much as you were waiting for them. But this person, they feel like you are their dream person. They feel like you are someone who is yeah on the same same wavelength as them they see you as an equal this person is two of cups at the bottom this person is feeling a very deep connection with you okay this this is someone who's feeling a very deep connection with you this is someone who is Seeing you as like the end all be all with the Ten of Cups. Seeing you as somebody who they can see themselves with a long term happy relationship, kids, marriage, if that's what you want. But they just see you as wanting to be with you for decades and decades to come. They're coming in with this, this offer. Um, they're, they're showing you through their actions that they are loyal they are committed and consistent this is someone who is um it feels like this month they are showing you even through like small even through small ways that they are consistent or they are committed okay but for this month it seems like maybe things are um progressing a little bit slower it's still progressing still progress but slower this person is um taking a moment to look at things differently or things from a different perspective. It feels like they may be kind of like in a limbo right now or something is like holding this situation up. Maybe it's just time. It feels like more like a timing thing. Why the hangs, man? The world or distance or distance. There could be distance. So this person is waiting. This person is willing to like sacrifice their time. If it means um, seeing things to con continuing to progress here. So this month they're, they're, they're willing to sacrifice something here or let go of something in order to, in order to manifest this, this new beginning okay i'm seeing the numbers four one three zero those numbers could be synchronicity special days i'm seeing letters m c k l s u those letters could be in your name or someone else's but with that said this is what i'm seeing um if it, 
yeah, if it resonates, let me know. And I hope that you have an amazing rest of your day, Leo. Bye.